Hello everyone and welcome to this video tutorial from visualknife.com. Today I'm going to show you how you can create an animated texture. Um, I've created it with 3ds Max 9 um, just for the record. Now the end result will look something like this. As you can see the sphere in the perspective view changes from the skin map to a leaf map. Now let's start from the beginning. Let's uh, erase this sphere, create a new one, or a box if that's what you want, go to the material editor and select a new uh, sphere to, go to make a new color map. Now go to maps and select, select the non box near diffuse color. Click on fall off. Now as you can see this is black with white sphere creating here. We have two slots with none. We click on the first none and click on bitmap. You could also choose a color which you want to um, make an animated texture from. But we are going to make an animated texture with actual textures. I'm going to select um, first one, let's say skin here. It's the first one. Um, you can change these properties here from this bitmap, but we're going to leave them for now. Um, go to the second slot with none and select a second bitmap. I'm going to choose a leaf here. <coughs> now what we have so far is this uh, ball which is a mix of the two textures. Now we don't for the easy part of this tutorial we're gonna select towards and away in the fall off type. Okay. Now we're going to drag this to the sphere. If uh, you can't see it, just like as you can see here now, we go all the way back to the um, main uh, color mapping uh, properties and you select this box here. That means you can see it in the viewport. Ah, there it is. Uh, go back to your fall off map. <clears throat> now scroll down and here you can see a curve. It's a mixed curve is this property called. What we're going to do, we're going to turn on Auto Key and drag this point here up to the top. Now we've done that, we have to make a little animation, of course. Um, as you can see, we're at frame 100 now. We go back to 0, make sure you have Auto Key turned on. And as you can see, this curve has changed a bit. Now we're going to drag this right point all the way down. And as you can see, the skin map is entirely visible now. But this is actually the entire tutorial. If we would play this animation, you would see how this animated texture would look like. So you also can see is this line here moving up and down again. And this is how the tutorial finishes. Please rate this video and visit visualnights.com for a while. And I hope to see you again. Bye!